of the most beneficial things you can do for yourself preparing for a big performing event is to record yourself playing run-throughs of your entire program. This can be an audition list, it could be a big solo, it could be recital music, anything. Recording ourselves helps us do a couple of things. First, it'll help us get used to shutting everything out of our heads and just playing the music. Second, you get to practice being in performance mode rather than being in practice mode. Third, it allows you to give yourself permission to shut the inner critic off and just play music. Last, you have the luxury to listen to the recording later and turn that inner critic back on to create an action plan for your next practice session. Here are some tips for making your practice time recordings really great. First, make it a run through and give that run through everything you got. Every ounce of musical energy you have in you, just put it all out there. Make your fortissimos powerful. Make those light staccato passages the lightest you've ever done. And aim for perfection. Second, if you mess up, no big deal, just keep going. This is a run through and you're practicing doing a run through in performance mode. So you keep going and you just let the mistakes happen. Don't go back and fix it. Don't stop and start over again. You have to get used to playing everything straight through. Take musical risks and cut loose. This gives you permission to shut the inner critic off and just be musical. Last, and I can't stress this enough, you've got nothing to lose, so go for it, 100%. When you go back and listen to your recording, bring a notepad and ask yourself the following questions. First question, what do I hear? This isn't, what did I do wrong? What sounds terrible? You're simply writing down, what do I hear? Second, what went well? If you took some really great musical risks, you're gonna wanna remember to do that every time you practice and every time you play it. Then, what didn't go well? This isn't, what did I stink at? It's, what didn't sound so great so I can be better? Once you have all the stuff written down, create an action plan to practice so the next time you do this run through, you can be even better. One really important thing to remember when you're listening back on yourself is not to put yourself down because putting ourselves down isn't going to help us get better. The important thing is to have a neutral mindset and just stick with the basic questions. What do I hear? What went well? What did not go well? And then create an action plan to get better. I really hope that these tips will help you get to the next level of your playing. Do you record yourself regularly? If so, go ahead and leave a message in the comments below so we can all learn from each other and get better. Thank you so much for watching and as always, happy practicing!